Hello, I'm Dwight Norris of FishNetwork.com and we're here at Paddle Boston in Alton, Massachusetts. I plan to get the canoe going with my son and we're going to do a little fishing in the local area just before it's time to eat dinner. So this is really spontaneous and I don't know what you'll see, but maybe you'll see some fishing, some fish. Once again, I'm out on the boat. Look at me out on the canoe right here at the Moody River, We're right next to the lily pads, which I can never reach. And I got on a little Panther Martin spinner. It's black and yellow. I saw somebody hitting it up at Old Ham Pond down south. And I'll try a couple things out. We'll see what happens. Hopefully I won't have to stare this boat too much. So nothing on the, uh, the spinner there, but putting on the crick hopper and let's see what happens because I want to check out some places here. It's been a rough time out here. Um, you know, it's late. It's mid to later September. It's a cool day, high of 60 degrees. It doesn't seem like anything is in the shallows. Just a couple days ago, we were catching some bluegills in the shallow water, but they were really hung up and a little finicky. Not as hungry as they used to be. And after you hit things once, they seem to have wised up. Now we're just rolling as slow as we can go down the river, running us to a clock tower right there, and see what happens. We actually have a little more time than I thought we did, but we gotta go home sooner than that. So I gotta make sure that I have enough power to go back against the current and the wind before we call it a day. The reason the swan is really interested in us, maybe he wants that crick hopper or we're in his territory. So, I'm gonna skedaddle. Finally, after my son scored, I scored too on the crick hopper. A nice little bluegill. Just before the bridge. There's the bridge over there, and there's that big building. And right here, there's, there's some trees falling in the water. There's some lily pads. Perfect place for crappy bass and bluegill.